have the Kensington. And this is size 44. And here we have the original before the rebranding. The Burberry's with the apostrophe at the end. And this is size 54. Here, you can feel that the fabric is much thinner on the new one. And it does not feel like 100% cotton anymore. Um, this one is 100% cotton. This might be a polyester cotton. Line. And one big change is that the pockets are no longer through pockets. They actually, you cannot put your hands through to access your pants on the inside anymore. Unlike this one, where you could put your hand here through the pocket and reach your pants pockets. Here, the inside button to hold it at a slightly open position has been moved further up here. Of course, this is size 54 and this is size 44, but um, this is still a big change. It's up here now. Overall, the belt is quite a bit thinner than this one. And yeah, you just get the feeling that this was a survival tool. And this is a piece of clothing now. You also have um, two extra pockets here in your chest, on the inside. Whereas the old one did not. It only had these these pockets down here by the uh, by the waist. The sleeves are more inset and they're no longer raglans. This is the original raglan sleeve and this is more inset now. This little part here, that in the back of the coat that you can expand has stayed the same and even the mechanism it's still kind of the same. The button is a bit smaller. But on the front, on the front, the old one had a little thing that keeps it more together at the bottom of your legs. And it actually came a bit stitched here, but it broke apart. So that you can use it with this button up here to keep it more open while having this thing kind of keeping it closed. But this Kensington does not have this anymore at the bottom. It is also shorter, so maybe that's why. Also the yoke is huge here. And over here, the yoke has been sewn in the middle. Mm -hmm. Not a difference. Just one hook. It's much looser, it's easier to do. This one, it's two hooks, they're much closer to the cloth. It's really quite difficult to get them together, especially when it's when you're wearing it. Then you have to, it, it kind of clicks together like a button. Don't know if it's just this unit. Look at that. Imagine having to do this when this thing's on you. Well, I guess that's it. Overall, I probably wouldn't pay 2,000 bucks for that.
Stop.